our studio audience are here to play some of your favorite games in a whole new way. Battleship, Operation, Sorry, Yahtzee, and Bop It. The games are bigger, the moments are priceless, and one lucky family might just leave here tonight with a brand new car. Plus, a celebrity family will play one of our games right here on Family Game Night, Celebrity Edition. And now, here's your host, Todd Newton. Thank you, Andrew. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. Oh, look at you. Ricky. Hey, guys. How are you? How are you? Boom. Hey, hup, 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 hup. Thank you so much. And thank you, folks at home. Welcome to Family Game Night. What a great audience we have. And you know what? We've got a great show tonight because we've got a bunch of larger than life games. And as always, every single contestant that you'll meet tonight, we're going to pick them right out of our audience here in Hollywood. Okay? All right. And the beautiful thing is one lucky family will get to play our Monopoly Crazy Cash game where they could win a brand new car. They could tonight. Now, if that wasn't exciting enough, coming up, we've got a surprise celebrity guest and their family who's going to join us to play one of our favorite games. Now, she's someone that you've seen on the red carpet for years. She's a lot of fun. It's going to be a very special night. But I want to know who wants to play our first game with me right now. for Cameron and Kevin. It's your turn to play. Here they come. Right over here, bud. How are you, Julie? Really good. Nice to you. meet nice you. To meet Hi, you. Sarah. How are you? Good. We're glad you're here. There he is. How you yeah. doing, big man? So you uh, ready to sink some ships? Yes. Yeah. Oh, yes. Yeah. How you doing, Kevin? Good. Good to meet you. All right. Well, we're going to have a little bit of fun. All of us are going to face the high seas playing Battleship. Yeah. All right. Now, we're going to hide a fleet of six ships on the Battleship grid. I'm going to tell you about these ships. I want you to know everything you could possibly know about them. Three of them are cruisers, and the cruisers stretch over two squares. Now, we have two submarines, and the subs take up three squares, and then we have the battleship. It's a big one. It stretches over four squares. There they are. Get to know them. Burn them on your brain. And let's cover up our grid. Hide those ships now, please. Guys, your job is to find the ships. And the way you do that is by calling out a coordinate and pressing your giant launch button to fire a peg right at it. I'm going to load up a peg right now. The audience likes to say, ooh, when we load it up. Watch this. They're so good. Now, if your peg hits a ship, it sinks and you score. You want to be the first family to sink three ships. If you can do that, you're going to win the game and you're going to win a top speed adventure package. Okay. Yeah, man. Right. Is this what you do to psych yourself up? A little bit of this? All right, there you go. Yeah. Sarah, what do you do to psych yourself up? Okay. All right, let's play Battleship. Sarah's family, you're first. Tell me which square you want to aim for. C4. C4. All right, you're going right in the middle there, huh? Let's lock it in for you. Let's count down from three, audience. I'll go three, two, one, then you hit launch, OK? okay. Three, three, two, one. Launch it. Here we go, and C4 is a hit. Go. Woo! Okay, you got one of those submarines. Over here. All right, your turn, buddy. Spot on the grid. What looks good? C1. Want to go C1? Other side over there? Okay. C1. We're going to lock it in. C1. Three, two, one. Launch it. And C1 is a hit. Nice shot. You guys are some battleship pros. OK. You each have one ship. First family to sink three is our winner. Back to you, Sarah and Julie. Um, um, B2. B2. 
Let's go B2, we'll lock it in. All right, audience, help us out. Three, two, one. Launch it. And B2, hit. You sunk that battleship. It's the big one. One more, you win the game. <laughs> I think Mom's more excited I than Sarah am, is. Okay. All right, you can tie it up again here, Cameron. Where are we going? B3. B3. Let's go B3. We're going to lock in that coordinate for you. It is locked in. Here we go. Three, two, one. Launch. And B3. Miss. All right. Okay. There are still three ships up there. Sarah, you can win the game right here. A3. I see what you're thinking. If there is a ship under A3, doesn't matter if it's a cruiser, doesn't matter if it's a sub, if there's anything under A3, you have won this game. Here we go. Three, two, one, launch, and A3 for the win. Boom! Because you've won Battleship, you have also won this, Andrew. You'll reach top speed at Knott's Berry Farm Theme Park. Home to world-class rides, shows, and attractions in five themed areas, including Old West Ghost Town and the beloved Camp Snoopy. And for more speed, you've won two spikes. Spike is the next step in the evolution of the scooter, featuring a front BMX wheel, wide maple deck for side-by-side -side foot placement, and more. The Spike provides fun for the whole family. All right. Let's go ahead and reveal the rest of the ships up there just so we can see where they were. And you guys played a great game. I tell you what, we want you to go have a little bit of fun, too. I'm going to give you $100 just for being here. Cameron, Sarah, come on up here with me. We're gonna choose a combination. Sarah, you can choose any combination you'd like. If it's the one that opens the community chest at the end of the show, you guys will go play the Monopoly crazy cash machine, possibly for a new car. Which one looks good? One. Wanna go this one? All right, let's get out of there, see what you chose. You gave me, turn you around here, orange, yellow, red. Feel good about it? Yes! Yeah. Hold on to that to the end of the show, okay? All right. Cameron, you can choose any one you like, my friend. How about that one? What do we have? We have green, blue, and red. All good? All good. Thank you, buddy. Great game. One of those will open the community chest a little bit later on. And now, as the action continues, I need one family to play a game with me. Just one. Who's it going to be? So many great families here tonight. and Mauricio. Here they come. Come on, high fives, Kayla. That's it. All right, there we go. Hi, Mom. How you doing, buddy? Hey. Good looking family. And when we come back, they're going to play our next game, Operation. Don't go anywhere. Welcome back. This is family game night. Kayla and her family have been selected to play Operation. I like this. Every dad loves Operation. Now, here's how we play. You're going to make money by rolling balls into Cavity Sam that you see right here. But you have to earn those rolls before you can earn that money. And you're probably saying, Todd, how do we do that? How do we earn those rolls? Well, you have to operate on a patient. And I'd like to introduce you to him right now. Come on up here, guys. Let's meet the patient. <laughs> right over there. Kayla's dad is here in a full body cast. He's been prepped for surgery. How are we doing, sir? 
You know what? I got a little itch in my head, though. Oh, do you really? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, out there, well, sure. Where is it? Right here? Yeah, all right. There you go. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, don't worry. Don't worry. Listen, you got an itch. It's going to get scratched. Right now, your family has a chance to win some cash. Nothing gets rid of those itches faster than some good old money. And this is the list of dad's ailments. Now, we have a chip on the shoulder here. We have tennis elbow over there, butterflies in the stomach, water on the knee here, and, of course, a Charlie horse. Now, for every ailment that you can successfully remove, you guys are going to earn a roll over there in Cavity Sam. Now, we're going to start you off with one free roll. That one is yours. That's just in case these giant tweezers cause a buzz. Now, what do I mean by that? Well, you can earn three more rolls by removing the ailments, but you have to be careful because in doing so, you may very well hit the edge, and when you do, that will happen, and your turn ends. I know, makes me jump too every single time. Now, who's gonna go first? Me. Kayla's gonna go first. All right, which ailment are you gonna go for, Kayla? The butterfly. Butterflies in the stomach. All right. Get it, get it, get it. Oh, she's got a steady hand. Look at this. Look at this. Get it out of there, Kayla. Yes. That's two rolls. Nicely done. All right, Leandro. Get it left. Going for chip on the shoulder. Oh, trying to make it work. I jump every single time. Okay. All right, one more shot, Angela. Oh, yes, let me get out. Oh, Charlie Horse. Ah! Okay. Boy. Okay. Uh, just hang tight, not like you're going to go anywhere. But we're going to head over here to Operation Sam, see how much money you can win with the two rolls you got. Two rolls. Line up right over here, please. OK. Guys, you can see that each of Sam's funny ailments are worth a different amount of money. You roll a ball into one of them, you get that amount of cash. If you miss, we'll give you $100 just for trying, OK? I always like to get uh, old Sam warmed up here. There's a nice little, there you go. So, oh. <laughs> See, I would have earned $700, and I'm just going to stand here like that happens all the time. It does not. OK, you've got two rolls. Who's going to go first? Me. Kayla? OK. All right, good luck, Kayla. Come on. What are you going to aim for? Uh, well, all right, whatever you got. You got $100 no. there, $100. OK, Leandro, what are we looking for? The bill. You're going to try and ring that bell? Oh. That's worth a 1000 bucks if you can do it. And... Oh, no! $1,100 playing operation. And I need you guys to choose a combination. Talk about it. Decide which one you think is going to open that community chest later on in the show. You have four to choose from. Which one are you going to choose, Kayla? I think this one. You want to go with that one? All right. Kayla has selected blue, yellow, and red. Blue, yellow, and red. Hold on to it. Don't let it go anywhere. Thank you very much. Nice job down there. Now it's time to pick the family who's going to join me for Sorry. We're going to play Sorry. Who's going to be my family here for this game? Let's see. Who is it going to be? You know who's going to join me for a game of sorry? Gianni and John. That's who. Here they come now. Come on up, guys. Your turn to play. How you doing, Gianni? Good to meet you. And here comes John. How are you, John? Yeah, doing great. What a pleasure. Yeah. You make sure you come back, because these guys are going to play sorry right yeah. after this. Everybody's excited because my man Gianni is right here. And where, where are you from, Gianni? You're not from Satellite California. Satellite Beach, Florida. Satellite Beach, Florida. Are you just here on vacation? I'm here for vacation and for family game night. My man, right there. My man. That's pretty cool. You come to California for vacation. Next thing you know, here you are on TV, right? Mm -hmm. What do you want to say to the folks watching back in Satellite Beach, Florida? Um, I want to say cheer for me and make, let me win. That's right. <laughs> We're cheering for you. Good deal. All right, my man. We're almost ready to play Sorry, but you know, because you watch us back at home, we need your dad. 
Now, to bring that out, you got to do the calling. I, he's not going to listen to me, so look over that way and nice and loud. Tell him to get out here. Dad, get over here. Oh, here we come. Oh, look at this. Yes, there he is. All right. Hey. You're giving all the neighbors something to talk about back home in Florida all right now. Okay. Object of the game, guys, is to get Dad from there all the way down to there. We call that home base. And you are in charge, Gianni. This is all about you. If you can get your dad down there to home base, you're going to win a vacation, another vacation. But this one, not to California, but to Jamaica. <laughs> this is how you're going to do just that. Right over here, my friend. We have 10 cards. You're going to pick a card and your dad will move the number of spaces on that card and collect the amount of money that's on the space upon which he lands. Two of the cards are ones, two are twos, two are threes, two are fours. Now, you have to be careful because two of the cards we have up here are sorry cards. If you pick a sorry card, dad's gotta go all the way back to start and you lose whatever money you've picked up along the way. If you pick the remaining sorry card, the game is over. We do not wanna see sorry cards, all right? You all set? Yes. Okay, come on. We're thinking Jamaica. We're thinking money. It's a beautiful day. What color do you want to start with? Uh, I'm going to start with blue. Blue, right here. All right. The blue card is worth two spaces. Two, ready? One, two. You got $200. Just like that. 200 bucks going in the bank. Now, you can stop at any point, Gianni, or we can keep going. Go. All right, let's go. I want to go with green. green. Green, right here. All right, you got $200 in the bank. The green card is worth three spaces. And here we go. One, two, three. We're going to put another 500 bucks in the bank, up to $700. You are five spaces away from the trip to Jamaica. You want to stop with 700 bucks? You want to keep going? I want to keep going. All right, you love a good vacation. What color? I want to go with yellow. Yellow it is. All right. You got $700 so far. Another space. Yeah. Take one. One. We add $600. You got 1,300 bucks. Woo. Now, Gianni. If you stop right now, I'll give you $1,300. But keep in mind, both of the fours are still up here. Find one of them, and you've won the game. What do you want to do? You want to stop or go? I want to keep going. All right, pick a color. I'm going to go with pink. Pink right here. All right. Now, if it's a four, they're going to Jamaica. The pink card is sorry. The first sorry card. That means dad's got to come all the way back. We lose the money that was in the bank, but the game doesn't have to be over. You could still win that trip to Jamaica. There's one sorry card left up there, but still plenty of numbers. Pick a color. I'm going to go with black. Black? We do not want it to be the other sorry card. That would mean the game is over. Black card. Three. Yeah. Good job. One. Two, three, all right. Put a little money back in the bank, $300. Do you want to stop there or do you want to go? No one, if you find keep another going. sorry card. Okay, oh. keep going. Oh. I'm going to go with orange. Orange, okay, come on. Not the, so we do not want the other sorry card. No, no, no. The orange card, four. Yeah. Woo. One, two. Three, four, another $700. You're back up to $1,000. Now, the other four is up there. That would bring it home and send you to Jamaica. The other sorry card is still up there. That would end the game. You want to stop with $1,000 or go? I'm going to keep going. All right. He said, I came all the way from Florida. I want to play. Pick a color. I'm going to go with. Purple, right here. Okay, come on. We would love for it to be that four. We would love for it to be that four. The purple card is worth two. Yeah. One, two, and another $900, 1,000. 
$900. All right, you are one space away. If you stop here, I'm gonna give you $1,900. You have three cards left. Two of them will send you to Jamaica. One of them will end the game. Do you wanna stop or do you wanna go? I'm gonna keep going. He's gonna go. Is it gonna be red, white, or brown? Red. Red, okay. Come on. Red. Please do not be the sorry card. Do not, do not, do not. The red card. I can't do it, you come to it. I don't, I don't want, the red card. Gianni, all the way from Florida, on vacation, turn that card over. If it's a number, you're going to Jamaica. Four! Come on, buddy! You got it! You got it! Mom and sister are here, too! What a family vacation this is! You have Trip. You're going to Jamaica! Franklin D. Resort and Spa, an all-sweet, all-inclusive boutique family beachfront resort in Jamaica, where each family is assigned a dedicated vacation nanny from check-in to check-out. Enjoy water sports, kids, preteens, and teens programs, live entertainment, and much more. All right, fantastic! Congratulations, congratulations. Hey, let's get you guys, oh, congratulations. Thank you, thank you. you did a heck of a job. <laughs> can I get you guys to join me up here at the community chest? You can stay there. I know it's hard to walk in there. Come on over. And by the way, the other sorry card was brown. I'm glad you didn't choose brown. Gianni, since you're on a roll, why don't you head right up there and choose one of those combinations. Okay. Which one's gonna open that chest, do you think? I'm gonna go with this one. All right. You have blue, red, yellow. It might open this baby right here a little bit later on, my friend. Good luck. Thank you. If it is, you'll be playing for a new car. How about that? Hey, you, stay right where you are. When we come back, a very special surprise celebrity guest and her family playing with us. She's a TV personality you all know and love. You've seen her on a ton of red carpets. Stick around. She will be here shortly. This is Family Game Night. Welcome back. It's good to have you with us on Family Game Night. Okay, it's time to play Yahtzee. And this one is really exciting. i tell you why, because we've got a special celebrity here, a very good friend. She brought some of her family and, uh, well, you wanna know who it is, right? Of course you do. Would you please welcome TV host, Melissa Rivers and her son, Cooper. Oh, yeah! There they are. Hello, my love. You look Hello. fantastic. You know, I would just like to say, I, I, I was at Cooper's one-year birthday party. He's grown up a little He's bit. He's 13 now. It's crazy. I know. Time goes we by too. Wait, well, let's not tell too way many back. people. Well, way back. Well I have an age. <laughs> you guys going to win some money for a wonderful yes. charity? Yes. Yes. All are... right. There's ten thousand dollars on the line. Who are we playing for? We are playing for our house grief counseling support centers. Beautiful. Which is thank you. Which is very near and dear to our heart. It offers grief support for all ages, and it's an amazing thing. They reach out to schools and, and offer support to, especially to kids who don't have the access to right, grief support yeah. and other resources when they're in a time where they've lost someone. Well, let's get it. Let's get it. That's great. I'm gonna play a little Yahtzee. Okay. Okay? Now, we know Yahtzee. We love Yahtzee. The goal, of course, is to roll the same number on each of five different dice in three rolls or less. Now, we call that Yahtzee. And if you get Yahtzee, the whole audience yells Yahtzee like this. Yahtzee! They're so good. If you can do that, you win the game, you pick up $10,000 for our house. That's what we want to happen. Okay. Now, listen, rolling a Yahtzee it's not as easy as we think, but you can make it a lot easier if you can answer a simple question. <laughs> it's a simple question, I promise you. The question is, which of these are true about Taylor Swift? <laughs> I only know who she's dated. 
<laughs> no, 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 I'm getting mad at her. All right, now I'm going to show you. Okay. Here's what I'll show you six possible answers. Okay. Three of them are correct. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Three of them are correct. Now, which of these are true about Taylor Swift? Her grandma was an opera singer. Her lucky number is 13. She was born in Toronto, Canada. She was discovered by an agent while singing karaoke. She grew up on a Christmas tree farm. And she was voted most popular in high school. All right, now remember, three of them are correct. For each correct answer you choose, one side of each die will turn to wild. If a die lands on wild, you can use it for any number you want. It makes getting a Yahtzee so much easier. All right, Melissa, okay. Cooper, who wants to go first? Okay, he's gonna, he, he's going to, lucky number 13, is it lucky number 13? Yeah. Okay. You like that number one? 13. All right. Go. Give it a little coop touch. There you go. Okay. Nice. There's one. Okay. Now, Melissa, um, I'm not gonna let you dodge it. Oh, God. <laughs> uh, was her grandmother an opera singer? <laughs> Just come on over and touch whichever one you want. Oh, they like that one. Kay. They like that one. Okay. Okay. I'll give you one more. Cooper, you gotta pick one more. Karaoke. 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 Okay. Let's see how many you have right. Now, remember, for each correct answer, you'll replace a number with wild on each side of the dice. Let's see. The first one you chose was uh, lucky number 13. Let's see if that's correct. Is her lucky number 13? It yes. is. Thank you, audience. OK. Moving on to the next one. Did Taylor Swift grow up on a Christmas tree farm? Let's see. Audience says yes. I think it says yes. Yes. So far, so good. So far, so good. Okay. Was she discovered while singing karaoke? Yes. Yes. No. No. Oh. no. All right. That one's not correct. Let's see what the third correct answer was. Either her grandma was an opera singer. Yeah. Yeah, there it was. Grandma was an opera singer. But you got two out of three. That's not bad yeah. at all. Yeah. Come on up here, guys. Let's go roll some dice. Melissa and Cooper looking for a Yahtzee. OK. Now, each of the dice that we're about to show you has two wild sides on it. Here come the dice now. There they are. And we're going to go ahead and get rid of all the ones, turn them into wild. And since they answered two questions correctly, let's get rid of the twos as well. Turn those into wilds. There they go. All right. Now we're going to roll them. Who's okay. up first? Yes. Coop. All right. All right. Let's roll the dice, please. Cooper, when you're ready, just hit that plunger to stop and the stop. dice. And stop. A six. Go ahead, go get, go get it. Go get it, go get it, go get it. Yeah. Go. And stop. And a three. Go again, you Next go one. Five. Wild, there you go. And stop. And a five. And go one go more. Go get go, go, go. And stop. Fifth one is a wild, okay. So we have two wilds. You can turn those into any number you want. For example, if you want to say, uh, I, yeah, I want to keep the five, you would essentially have three fives there, OK? Uh, it's up to you guys. The object is to get five of the same. So what, keep? what would you like to keep? Do you want to keep the five? Do you want to keep the three? I think you keep, keep the, the six? five. You want to keep, keep the, the five? five. Okay. So come on over here, Cooper. There you go. You get right underneath that five and just give it a nice hit. Just jump right over here, or else I'm going to do it, because I love this part so much. OK, there you go. All right, there you go. You got the five. So, oh, you want to keep the wilds, too? Can I keep one of the wilds? OK, because I get fancy with this. Ready? That's right. That's right. That's for you in the top row. OK. And you can do the other wild. He's good. Nice. All right. OK. Oh, I threw my shoulder out of the socket. OK. <laughs> So uh, we've got three fives essentially, and we need two more to get that $10,000 for our house. Yes. You ready to roll the dice? Yes. OK, let's roll the dice, please. OK. I'll do it. OK. Stop. 
Yes! You get another five. Yeah, there it is! $10,000! Wow! Nice. I'm not messing around, huh? How about it? They love it. $10,000 for our house. Come on, bam, bam, bam. Perfect. Melissa and Cooper, thank you guys so much. One more time for Melissa and Cooper. Aren't they great? And for our house, stay right where you are. Bop it is coming up next. Don't go anywhere. Welcome back to Family Game Night. It is time to pick two families to join me for Bop It. Who's it going to be? Marissa and Evelyn, it's your turn to play. And I need another family, don't you know? It will be Jaden and Zyda. Hello, Marissa, how are you? Hi, Evelyn. Hi, nice. nice to meet you. It's Papa time. Yeah! Is this the game you were hoping you'd get to play if you yes. got called up? Good. You've been practicing? Yes. You, you were wondering? Yes. Okay. Well, wonder no more, Miss yes. Marissa. It's good to have you here. Hello, Jaden. How are Hi, you? Good. And Zyda, how are you? I'm great, thank you. And who's this lovely young lady who's going to be your cheerleader? Bianca. Bianca. Hi, Bianca. It's nice to meet you. All right. Let's all go back to the Boptagon, shall we? Right back here. We go. All right. Lots of ladies for Boppa today. This is how you play the game. Scoot on in here. Don't be too far away from me. There you go. You get 30 seconds to complete as many commands as you can. The commands that we have, if you would hold that for me, Marissa. The commands we have are hawk it. We have crash it. We have lift it. We have chop it. Pull it. Here, of course, is squeeze it. Right here is dunk it. And everybody's favorite, Bop it. There you go. Now you complete a command, you'll hear another one. You want to go as quickly as you can until your time runs out. The team that completes the most commands wins the game and gets a fun on the go package. That'll be very cool. Fun on the go. Up first is Marissa. Step into the Boptagon, please, Marissa. We're going to put 30 seconds up on the clock. Those seconds will start tick, tick, ticking away as soon as you hear your first command. Are you ready? I am ready, Todd. Good luck to you, young lady. Here we go. Chop it. Honk it. Pull it. Crash it. Crash it. Chop it. Dunk it. Pull it. Squeeze it. Squeeze it. Chop it. Bop it. All right. In 30 seconds, you got 12. That's very good. Very, very good. Now, Jaden, it is your turn. Step. You got your special cheerleader there, Bianca. This is going to be good. 30 seconds on the clock for you. Let's see what you can do. Here comes your first command. Bop it. Chop it. Lift it. Crash it. Dunk it. Lift it. Chop it. Squeeze it. Bop it. Squeeze it. Crash it. Oh, time's up. You got 10. It's a close game. Nicely done, Jaden. All right. Now it's the mom's turn. All right, Evelyn. <laughs> Evelyn, a <laughs> little good luck hug there. Marissa got 12. Let's see what you can add to that. 30 seconds on the clock for you. Good luck. Find your center. Here comes your first command. Squeeze it. Pop it. Lift it. <laughs> Chop it. Squeeze it. Lift it. Honk it. Dunk it. Lift it. Honk it. Crash it. Squeeze it. Dunk it. Chop it. And time's up a total of 25. 
Very good. Very good. All right. Zaida, your turn to step into the Bhaptagon. Now, you need 15 to tie. You need 16 to win. 30 seconds on the clock. Good luck to you. Here comes your first command. Squeeze it. Dunk it. Crash it. Pull it. Lift it. Chop it. Crash it. Dunk it. Chop it. Pull it. Chop it. Dunk it. Pop it. Lift it. Oh, so close. So close, but not enough. That means Marissa's family has won. The Bop It Bop to go. Congratulations. And for winning Bop It, Andrew's going to tell you about your fabulous prize. Andrew. Get ready to ride the Mobo Triton and the Mobo Triton Pro. These ultra maneuverable three wheeled cruisers are made for children and adults with an adjustable frame, simple steering mechanism, and low center of gravity, providing a smooth and comfortable ride. Don't forget your helmet. The Mobo 360 degrees LED light helmet provides safe riding at night and in other conditions. Mobo Cruiser. And for more fun on the go, you've won the Nintendo 3DS XL. This portable handheld gaming system is home to exclusive titles like Super Mario 3D Land, Yoshi's New Island, and Kirby Triple Deluxe, all three of which are included in your prize pack. All right, nicely done. Enjoy all of that. That's very cool. And Bianca, come here. I tell you what, since you are such a great cheerleader, for your family, there's a $100 bill. You guys can all go get a little something nice, OK? All right, you're welcome. Jaden, Marissa, join me right up here by Mr. Monopoly. There are two combinations left. Uh, Marissa, we'll let you choose the first, okay. since you won the game. Which one will it be? All right, we have blue, orange, and green. That's for you to hold on to just for a few minutes. And Jaden, that one is all yours. Let's see what it is. All right, how about green, red, orange? Feel lucky about that? All right, there you go. Great game, everybody. They're gonna hold on to those combinations to see who will move on to the crazy cash game and maybe even win a new car. All of that is coming up next. Don't you go anywhere, no. We're back on Family Game Night. Here it is. Time, ladies and gentlemen, to see which of these lovely families is holding that secret combination to unlock the community chest. They all want to have it because if they've got that secret combination, they move on to play our crazy cash game. And that is where they are guaranteed to win some real money. And look at those faces. They love money. Maybe even a new car. It's going to start with you, Sarah. Let's come right over here. We have your combination. What I'm going to ask you to do is put it right in there. It'll lock in here, and when it does, you hit that red button. All right? Orange, yellow, red. Hit the button. Let's see if the chest opens. If it does, you move on. No. I'm sorry. Thank you guys so much. Nice meeting you. Bye, Sarah. All right. Here comes Cameron and Kevin. OK, Cameron, you ready? All right. Look of determination. Right in there you go. All right, leave it in. We have green, blue, red. Hit that button, Cameron. Let's see if it opens the community chest. Oh, no. Thank you so much. Here you go. Will you take that with you? All right. Otherwise, I'll eat it. OK, Kayla. Hello, Kayla and family, Operation family. Right in there. Winning $1,100, blue, yellow, red. When you're ready, hit that button. But at least we got that itch taken care of. That's why that was important. Thank you, guys. And Leandro, great job over in operation, ringing that bell. Gianni, G. Here comes G. All right, right in there, sir. OK, we have blue, red, yellow. You ready to hit that button? Let's hit it. Down to final three families. It's got to be one of you. Will it be you? Ah, no. Thank you, Gianni. All right, nice to meet you. John, thank you. Thank you. All of a sudden, just the ladies. Look at the Boppet Queens. All right, let's see which family's holding the winning combination. Marissa and Evelyn, put it right in there. One of the final two combinations left in Mr. Monopoly. We have blue, 
orange, green. When you're ready, Marissa, hit the, oh, they're gonna hit it together. Good luck. If not, it's all you guys. Here we go. Hit that button. All right. They're holding it together. Crazy cash machine, we go. <laughs> All right. Congratulations, you guys. First you win Bop It, then you open the community chest. Nicely done. Time to play the Monopoly Crazy Cash Machine. And right over there, four rows of Monopoly Crazy Cash cards. Now, on the top row, one is a win card. That's the one you want, because that's the one that will win you a brand new car. <laughs> And it will just sit in your driveway until you get your license. Or for my grandma. Or for, for your grandpa. OK, all right, there you go. Even better. Now, to get to the top row, you have to work your way up from the bottom row. You pick cards that are worth cash. Any money you win is yours to keep. We never take money back. It's yours to take home with you. But be careful, because if you choose a go-to-jail card, that ends the game. We don't want that to happen. We want you to go right to the top. Now, down here on the bottom row, they are all worth different amounts of money. No go-to-jail card down there, Marissa. So come on over. Anyone you choose is a good one. All right? What do you say, Mom? <laughs> skateboard. All right. Now put it right in there. Let's see how much money the skateboard is worth. $700. Catch that money. Catch that money. All right. You've got $700 no matter what. That is yours. You're going to move on to the next row. Now, in the next row, there is one go to jail card, but three of them are worth money. All right. Come on over here. Which one will it be? The cat. All right. What are your cat's names at home? Peanut and Kitty. Peanut and Kitty. OK. Well, let's do it for Peanut and Kitty. Do not be the go-to-jail card, please. $750. Brings your total to $1,450. And on to the next row we go. All right, now in this row, two go-to-jail cards. Okay. But two of them are worth money, OK? All right, good luck. I like that smile. I like that smile. Let's see if you can add to that $1,450. It's a horse. All right, put it right in there. OK. I love a horse named Elvis. That's a good name. Ah, your go to jail card. Go to jail card. But you've got $1,450. And your prize, of course, from the Bop at Boptagon. And just so you know, the winning card tonight was soda. It was the soda card. Congratulations. Thank you so much, Evelyn. Thank you. Thanks to all of our families. And thanks to you and your family for watching. Melissa Rivers and Cooper, we love you. We'll see you next time on Family Game Night. Good night, everybody.